Hello and welcome back, sweet bean! I'm Chelsea, also known as Chelsea Cloud Kitten on Twitch. Thank you for coming back to my YouTube channel. It's such a pleasure to have you here again. Today we are doing the third episode of Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. In the last episode, we just got Zelda to join our party. Burgeoning Scholar Princess! I gave her so much sass because she was just standing around. I cannot simply stand by- FINALLY! <sighs> Waiting to be protected from the Guardian. She wasn't contributing anything and in the past Hyrule Warriors game, she was one of the, um, the heroes. Like, she was battling and stuff, so I was so confused as to why we needed to protect her. But she came through, she came through. She started using the Sheikah Slate to her advantage and she started battling and it was awesome. Happy to see you here again. Let's see how much progress we'll make today in episode three. Let me know in the comments below if you've played this game already or if you're just tuning in because you wanna see the storyline and I purely just want to play it for the storyline. Anyway, let's get to it. Where did we leave off? Oh, hey, cool, there's a two player mode. I wonder what that's like. I probably will never find out because I don't tend to play two-player games. <laughs> okay, so it seems like the game wants me to travel to here, so let's try this. Oh, we're only using Link for this one, okay. Mastering remote bombs. Okay, defeat a hundred. Am I only using bombs? I guess not. I guess I can't really just do bombs because uh, I need my meter to replenish. So why did it say master bombs? Because it's going up even if I don't use bombs, or like my kill count is going up even if I don't use the bombs to kill them. I'm confused. Oh, you guys can't even see the objective again. Voila! De I've defeated 98, so I need to defeat two more. Hundred! Woo! <laughs> so good! Okay, capture the outpost. Okay, let's go. practice for me to uh, practice the combinations because I was saying in the last few episodes that I'm never gonna remember all these combinations oh oops oh special attack success easy peasy lemon squeezy <clears throat> okay now we're to defeat fire whiz rogue okay Ooh. Oh. Um, how do I use my third lighter again?
wasn't close enough, damn. Oh, okay, cool. Yeats. I did it. Got the fire rod. Nice. Cool. Ah, it's also a good way to level up the characters. Because I probably won't be using um, Zelda and Impa very often, so I guess doing these things with Zelda and Impa will help me level them up for the times that I do have to use them. Because games like to do that, they like to force you to use the characters that you don't actually want to use. <laughs> Okay, cool. More battlefields unlocked. <laughs> What's that? It's telling me to go here. Oh, Brawny Blacksmith. Oh, okay. So I can level up my weapons <gasps> then. I'm assuming. Contributions to Hyrule. Complete quests in the region to contribute here. Work together with the... <laughs> what is with these words? Denizens? Denizens? <laughs> Across the kingdom to grow stronger and fight against calamity. Okay. Uh, by fusing weapons with your base weapon, you can forge it into something even stronger. You can sell any unneeded weapons too. Oh, cool, cool, cool. Okay, let's go visit here then. Fuse weapons. Uh, okay, we'll start with Link. Uh, raise a base weapons level to... Okay, this is what I was looking for. Raise a base le uh, weapons level and power by fusing it with other weapons. These are consumed, uh, but will pass on one or more seals that augment a weapon. Uh, more of the consumed weapons level is higher. Of course. But they're all level one, so. Um, okay, what happens here? Let's, let's fuse together a broadsword with the Boko Club. Let's see what happens. It goes up to level three, okay. And looks like this, the sharpness goes up to 15. <laughs> okay, so now I have a level 15. No, sorry, level three with a strength of 15 broadsword. Okay. What happens if I fuse that? with this, and this, and this, and this. 200 rupees? I got lots of rupees, it's cool. Ah, we got a very strong training sword now. <laughs> um, let's fuse it some more, I guess. Uh, do I wanna use the boomerang yet? No, we'll, we'll save that. Save that for later. Well, let's just fuse them all together, why not? <laughs> nice. Ugh, oh, so close to filling the meter of the XP. Um, you know what? Okay, that's fine. Impa, okay. We got a stronger weapon for Impa. Let's just, yeah, let's just do it. Fuse them all. Oh. <laughs> Um, okay, and then Zelda. Well, naturally, we're just gonna fuse all of these. <laughs> oh, it's cause, oh, okay, equip. Ah, there we go. Gotcha. You have to equip the one that you want to fuse everything to, okay. <laughs> 
cool. Yeah, so I want to equip that one, obviously. And yeah, we'll just fuse that. I'm spending a lot of rupees here because I kind of screwed up. It's okay, so learning experience, it's fine. Um, and yeah, I, I guess I'll just keep that as a boomerang for now. It's fine. it's fine. Well, I'm not selling, obviously. And yeah, I guess that's all we can do here. Cool. Oh, and we also have a cooking space. Okay. Ah, you got the fire going and cooked for the first time. And now with a pot of fire and right ingredients, uh, you'll be able to cook a variety of dishes. Do it whenever you need uh, sustenance. I always need sustenance. <laughs> okay, cool. Okay, what else is this? Pumpkin burglars? A shop- oh, a shop- <laughs> it's a shop. <laughs> I was like, what burglars? Um... Yeah? You did well. Uh, with honey and honeycomb, the owner of the field uh, could lure bees to the pumpkin patch. The vocal bo blends hate bees. Mm, I didn't know that. Uh, well, I guess that makes sense. We all... No, we don't all hate bees. I don't know what I'm saying. Okay. Uh, that fixed everything. So the shop owners have... Oh, it's like a little side quest. Okay, okay, okay. So the items that I'm collecting when I do the main quest helps out all these little side quests on the map. That's cute. Uh, the various shops sell different materials. Be sure to check them out. They might just be uh, carrying what you're looking for. Yeah. Okay, well, I guess we can check it out. Um, I don't think I have anything to sell. Oh, I have lots to sell. If we're gonna go through all this stuff. Wait, I have all these things. Can I not eat them? Okay, well, I don't wanna sell that. I also don't wanna buy anything. I don't need to buy anything. Okay. So then... Where is the pot? Oh, okay, well, I'm still going through, like, this tutorial thing. Oh, no, wait, okay, we're going into a battle. Okay, we'll do- we'll do the cooking thing later, I guess. Oh, it's still just Link. Um... Do I have any new armor? No. Not that it really matters. Oh, wait. Where's all my cooking? Um, yeah, like, why? <laughs> I can't cook anything. Wait, I'm confused. Oh, you have to zoom in. I'm so dumb. Oh, my God. Okay, completed that. What's that? The Frontiers of Knowledge? Uh, sure. Uh, when you gave Princess Zelda the monster parts, her eyes lit up, and she rushed off to continue her work on the Shiga Slate expansion. Your new research would proceed smoothly now. Cool. More combos? No, I'm not ready. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> um. Okay. Okay. Just Y Y X Y X. Stuff like that, okay. I can do that. That's fine. <laughs> um Yeah, okay, let's let's just do all these little things here. That's cool. Uh with the materials Link provided, the sword swordmaster built a perfect classroom. As thanks for his help, she offered to let him join the class. More combos! Okay. Okay, it's just it's just more Y button. I can handle that, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get more combos. Hopefully they're easy. Uh, the Swordmaster was delighted to see Link return to the class. Mm. The Swordmaster was delighted to see Link return to the classroom with proof of the Lizalfo's Liz defeat. Uh, she passed along the good news to the villagers. Oh, <laughs> so many combos. Okay, um, yes, cooking. I want to do cooking. I don't have enough resources! Oh no! <laughs> okay, so much for that idea. Um, 
Yeah, okay, this is what I wanted to do. This is where um, our little mini guardian friend was telling us to go. some of these new combinations. <laughs> I wanted to sprint. There we go. targeted by accident. <laughs> well, that was lame. Oh, weak point. Okay, nice. I was trying to be fancy with the paraglider and I ended up flying higher. <laughs> I just keep hitting these freaking flame barrels. <laughs> That's not good. Okay, so the objective here is defeat the Breach Demise monsters. Okay, where are we going? We're, this is a cave. I don't need to go in there. Uh, this way. Definitely didn't want to do that. It's fine. Everything's fine. Uh, oh, I had to defeat 500 of these enemies and I'm at 449. Just noticed. Just keep 
blowing myself up. <laughs> Ugh. Ooh, a new weapon for Impa. Cool, cool, cool. Ooh, it's nighttime. All right. Uh, that's what I just completed, right? Oh, okay. He wants me to go here now. Okay. Let's go. Oops. Did not mean to do that, but it works. It's fine. Slide down on our pot lid here. Okay, defeat the Lavalsos. I need to defeat 300 in five minutes. the objectives would show on the other side because <laughs> I just feel like if my face was on the other side of um, the screen it would just look weird because I wouldn't actually be looking at like the content you know does that make sense I'm at 44 out of 300 four minutes left enemies are this way. Oh, all my kitties here. Hello, kitty. Okay, I want to go this way where the bulk of them are. Oh god. Ouch. Stop me! <laughs> Alright, I'm at 214 and I have just under two minutes to go. Okay, let's go to the area where there are a bunch of enemies. There we go. We got this.
god, there are like no enemies. Eighteen more to go. Eleven more to go. Five more to go. Three more! Okay, where are they all? Dead. Let's go. Oh, that was close! <laughs> I had like 15 seconds left to complete that. Yeah. <laughs> exactly 15 seconds left. Oh dear. All right, more weapons, more goodies. Um, okay, so. What's this? Oh, I still don't have the materials. Ooh, I have materials for this, cool. Uh, with the renovations complete, plus uh, the deluxe fruit you brought, the stable master finally held the grand reopening of his stable. You're now welcome to drop by anytime. But like, can I actually? House for stable is now available. The traveler merchants of Hyrule have set up a trade association of sorts. As a result, you can now purchase rare items at stables uh, that traveling merchants have visited. Okay. Oh, I can visit. Oh, that's all it is. I don't actually, like, go there. I s <sighs> okay, I don't need anything. Thanks, friend. Thank you. Um, how do- what? Oh, you know what? Maybe I'll just buy these material. Okay, I don't know- I don't remember what they're called. They're, like, flowers, herbs of some sort. Okay, so it's the red one. Red one and the purple one. Oh, is he just selling fish? That's all he's selling. Okay. I don't need that. What about the other guy? There was another one, wasn't there? Am I crazy? What about this one? Yeah. Oh, okay, here we go. Nope, not what I'm looking for. Uh. Damn it! <laughs> what about this? Okay. Oh, I'm missing the bugs. Damn it. Okay, what about this one? Ooh, I got the stuff for this. I knew I could do it. Uh, seeing the luminous fireflies from his beloved hometown, the merchant's face uh, crinkled, crinkled into a warm. Oh, the merchant's face crinkled into a warm, nostalgic smile. Uh, now that home didn't feel so far away, he could happily return to work. Oh, I got another heart! For Impa! Yes! Ooh, more stuff unlocked. Okay. I am stronger than before. Monsters who tried to uh, encroach upon Kakariko Village found themselves ensna ensnared in traps. Okay, monsters who tried to encroach upon Kakariko Village found themselves ensnared in traps, uh, making it easy for villagers to fend them off. The scene gave Impa inspiration for a new move. Cool. More stuff. Let's do it. Um... The innkeeper was uh, relieved she could take a day off uh, from tending to the goddess statue. Others in the village, inspired by Link's generosity, will help with the offering going forward. Yo, Link is so strong. Okay, is that- oh, there's another thing down here. Got stuff for this too! <laughs> Oh, 
I can see the material right there before I actually go into it. Oh. Well, now I don't need to waste my time to, like, actually go into the shop and see that they're not selling what I want. Okay. Zora's Domain is, um, the next one, the next challenge. The next chapter. Okay, well, that wraps up episode three of Age of Calamity. So I guess today we didn't really do any, um any story stuff. I guess if we just did the story, the game would go by really, really fast. We did some side quest stuff. We unlocked a whole bunch of stables and shops and helping villagers. More combinations that I am going to have difficulty remembering. Actually, no, because it was just like adding the Y button and the X button at the end of the combination. I really hope you're enjoying the videos, otherwise why would you be here? Of course you're enjoying them. I hope you've subscribed by now, because if you haven't, then what are you doing? And looks like episode 4 is going to be going into Zora's domain. So, if you're a fan of the Zoras, like I know you are, <laughs> then please do tune in to episode 4. See you next time!